Let's look at the topic one that is recruitment process as we already discussed recruitment is nothing but uh, you know trying to you know uh, attract more number of employees to apply for that you know vacant post that's what exactly recruitment is all about. Now let's try to look at what is the definition uh, it says recruitment is a process of searching the candidate for employment and stimulating them to apply for a job in the organization that's what exactly the definition or a meaning of recruitment and the exact meaning you know recruitment is the activity that links the employers and the job seekers so that means on one side if you look into it company wants particular job or you know post to be get filled on the other side if you look into it there are a lot of talented employees are there there, there has to be a proper kind of a bridge and uh, exactly you know the right kind of a candidate has to apply for the right kind of a job and we need to get the right kind of an application form that's the biggest kind of a challenge for an organization and uh, this recruitment process will act as a kind of an you know link between uh, the employers and the job seeker and it's a process of finding and attracting and capable applicants for employment because sometimes what happens is like if we do a wrong kind of an you know uh, recruitment strategy we may not be able to attract a talented kind of a pool to our uh, system so the recruitment strategy you need to be very very careful about it so that's the definition of an you know or a meaning of an recruitment and uh, recruitment needs are all you know basically three major types one is planned kind of a recruitment and another one is anticipated recruitment and the third one is unexpected kind of a recruitment the name itself implies it's a quite common sense planned kind of a recruitment in the, in the sense like uh, there is a different you know uh, huge kind of a change which is happening in the organization and because of the change in the organization we try to you know probably uh, work out a kind of you know planned way take an example let's say recently um, all banks have started conducting an you know huge kind of a recruitment uh, for the probationary officers the basic idea is like there are more number of people will be get retired in the year 2015 and 16 so there's a huge kind of a vacancy and you know openings in banks and all so that's that's a planned kind of a recruitment because there is a change in the organization there is a, actually you know need arises because of the changes in the organization and second kind of a thing is our anticipated kind of an you know recruitment anticipated kind of a recruitment in this in the sense like you know uh, every year the trend changes they, you know uh, this is because the trend is changing mainly because of the internal as well as external kind of an environment when we talk about internal environment your own company is trying to you know probably tighten up these uh, screws and uh, try to you know probably bring about the new kind of a policy or when uh, when your own organization has been taken over by some other company or when your company has been actually you know merged or joined with, had a joint venture with some other organizations or externally there could be you know economy recessions or economy is doing very well and new kind of you know other uh, employment opportunities have generated these are the kind of reasons what happens is like you can anticipate that there will be a lot of people will be leaving there will be new people will be coming up and how do we you know probably try to fill that particular post that's what exactly anticipated kind of an you know recruitment and third category is your unexpected kind of an you know recruitment uh, the name itself implies unexpected in the sense like suddenly there is a uh, people who are leaving the organization and going because of the resignation because of the death of an employee or accident of an employee or illness of an employee these are all gives an un, you know unexpected kind of an uh, what you call it is uh, vacancy get generated in the uh, organization so that's a way actually you know recruitment need uh, will be totally different so these are the ways actually you know recruitment needs uh, can be broadly classified into three major types one is a planned one and the second one is anticipated one and the third one is unexpected one now let's try to look at the importance of in recruitment uh, basically the idea behind or a concept behind the recruitment is to attract and encourage more and more candidates to apply for that particular organization because getting the right kind of a quality of cv itself is the biggest kind of a you know challenging task so you you know using this particular recruitment we can able to attract more number of uh, good quality uh, talent pool and uh, using that particular thing we try to you know generate a data bank what you call your cv bank and using that particular cv bank we try to you know go ahead with the selection process further and ultimately you know recruitment is the process which links the employers with the employee and uh, it increases the pool of job candidate in a minimum cost that means by doing an you know mass kind of an effect we could able to you know collect more number of pool of data 
and pool of you know your uh, CVs and other things which helps in increasing the success rate of the selection process because in the selection process if we uh, offer one candidate the one candidate may not join so you may have to offer for 10 candidates out of the 10 candidates probably you know three or four candidates might join so that's a way we can able to fill the particular position so these are these are the importance of the recruitment and uh, if you look at the recruitment process uh, it is it is a sequential process uh, first step is identify the vacancies what are the kind of a vacancies are there in your organization and second one is actually you know once we identify the vacancies second step is for that particular vacancy what is the kind of a job descriptions what are the kind of a job you know people are expected to do what are the personal specification and what you call it as your job specification what is the kind of a quali qualification is required and what kind of a people you are looking at and uh, what kind of an experience and skill set you are looking at all this thing we need to specify very clearly and once that has been clarified the same has to be indicated via uh, you know probably through an advertisements release an advertisement in the market uh, using an you know newspaper or a magazine or you know probably the electronic portals uh, through that you know job portals and all we can able to attract more number of CVs and uh, one, once we given an advertisement there will be a lot of responses will come and all the kind of you know CVs or probably all the responses we cannot consider we may have to shortlist and manage the responses and make sure that you know out of which we need to shortlist whichever actually closely uh, probably satisfying the criteria of your selection uh, you know uh, requirement and based on that you know we need to arrange for an interview with the shortlisted candidates and once we arrange for an interview whichever people uh, you know got shortlisted in that particular interview has to be you know taken for the further decision making and we need to conduct an interview and uh, take a decision making as to whether to offer that particular uh, post for that individual candidate or not so these are the ways the recruitment process happens so if you look at it actually you know the recruitment process uh, you know it's a, it's a very uh, cyclical process and it keeps happening throughout the year you know the recruitment process will be keep going on so these are the ways actually you know if you look into it recruitment has to be carefully planned and each vacancies and descriptions and specifications has to be you now worked out very very uh, clearly